हेलो स्टूडेंट्स माय सेल्फ सागर चौकसी फ्रॉम एलजे इंस्टीट्यूट्स ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग एंड टेक्नोलॉजी सो इन प्रीवियस सेशन वी हैव स्टार्टेड चैप्टर नंबर टू दैट इज प्रोडक्शन प्लानिंग एंड कंट्रोल एंड वी हैव ऑलरेडी कंप्लीटेड द फर्स्ट टॉपिक दैट इज टाइप्स ऑफ प्रोडक्शन सिस्टम सो इन टूडे सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट प्रोडक्शन प्लानिंग एंड कंट्रोल प्रोसीजर इट्स ऑब्जेक्टिव एंड इट्स इंपॉर्टेंस सो इन टूडे सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट procedure of production planning and control role of production planning and control and its objectives so let's start the lecture so first of all first question is overview of production planning and control so what do you understand by production planning and control first of all okay so it is the combination of three word first word is production number 2 is planning number 3 is controlling so now what do you understand by production so production is to convert raw material into final product so now second one is planning what do you understand by planning it depend on operation operation planning okay product layout planning okay worker load planning this is called one type of planning okay now the third word is controlling so what do you understand by controlling first of all after completion of your product you must check your product okay you must inspect inspect your product okay or during the process you must check your product this is called controlling okay so this is the integration of production planning and control okay so this is what production planning and control it depend on pre planning of meeting the production target by most economical and efficient method number 2 how it is developed okay so ppc or production planning and control involved to manage various kind of resources various kind of machining tools this is what production planning and control so what is the goal of production planning and control so it is very important because ppc or production planning and control is the tool which adjust modify or update your uh, production plan so this is called production planning and control so basically production planning and control it is combination of three word first word is production number two is planning third one is controlling so here i have attached one video that directly related to production planning and control so phases of production planning and control so here i have attached one video that directly depend on phases of production planning and control so here there are four phases first phase is planning phase so what do you understand by planning phase okay so it depend on operation phase of it depend on operation it depend on raw material okay based on that raw material you have to select how much raw material are used in that particular product okay so third one is product uh, plant layout according to operation sequences according to operation you must select your plant layout so this is called planning phase number 2 that is process phase after completion of planning phase process uh, process phase are carried out okay process phase that depend on operation so this is very important planning phase and process phase number 3 that is implementation phase after completion of planning phase and process phase implementation phase are carried out in implementation phase different types of operation are carried out okay so this this is very important after completion of implementation phase control phase are carried out during the process you must check your product you must inspect your product or you can also take after completion of your process you must check your uh, you must check your product okay so this is called phases of production planning and control there are mainly four phase planning phase that depend on operation planning that depend on sequence planning that depend on product layout or you, you can also take plant layout okay number 2 that is process phase process phase that depend on operation sequences third one is implementation phase are carried out so move forward to another question that is procedure of production planning and control so here i have attached one video that directly depend on procedure of production planning and control so there are mainly eight step in procedure of production planning and control so the first and important step is material control 
so now what do you understand by material control basically material control that depend on raw material availability okay raw material availability so now what do you understand by raw material availability so that depend on operation according to operation or based on that operation you must calculate how much material required in that particular process so this is called material control this is called raw material availability now second step is product design it is the combination of two word first word is product number two is design so what do you understand by product design so before start your operation you must check out product design because ultimately it is very important you must follow rules and regulations for same number 3 that is process planning so what do you understand by process planning so process planning that also depend on operation sequences and based on that operation sequences your plant layout are developed so process planning is also very important so move forward to next step that is equipment and tool planning so what do you understand by equipment and tool planning without any machineries without any machining tools without any holding devices process can't be produced okay so equipment and tool planning are also very important its availability is also very important so this is called procedure of production planning and control here in this slide there are four step first step is material control that related to raw material number 2 that product design it is very important to produce your product number 3 that is process planning that depend on operation sequences fourth one is tool planning or machineries machining tools this is also very important so move forward to another step that is loading and scheduling these two topics are related to process planning we will see these two topics in next session it is very important that related to process planning seventh one is implementation so after completion of raw material controlling after completion of tools and equipment planning after completion of product design operations are carried out so about what do you understand by control phase okay so basically after completion of your product you must check your product you must inspect your product or it is also done during the process so this is called control phase so this is the procedure of production planning and control these are the steps of production planning and control basically it started from raw material then product design then tool and equipment planning then loading scheduling implementation and last one is controlling this is very important because it increase our efficiency it increase our productivity so this is the procedure of production planning and control so move forward to another question that is objectives of production planning and control so the first and important objective is to deliver quality of goods in demanded quantity by the customer as per the delivery schedule as per the delivery timing number 2 that is to allocate and to assign the work to different divisions or to different department because ultimately utilization of worker is very important third one an important one is to plan the plant layout to effective utilization of machineries ultimately it depend on operation sequences based on that operation sequences you must check your plant layout okay you must develop your plant layout fourth one is to maximize the use of plant capacity and last one is to maintain the flexibility in manufacturing operation so these are the objectives of production planning and control it ultimately increase your efficiency it ultimately increase your productivity so production planning and control is very important so move forward to another question that is procedure of production planning and control so here i have attached one image that directly related to cycle of production planning and control so the first and important target is raw material okay raw material availability is necessary 
नंबर टू दैट इज प्रोसेस प्लानिंग और ऑपरेशन प्लानिंग इट इज ऑल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थर्ड वन इज प्रोडक्ट डिजाइन विदाउट प्रोडक्ट डिजाइन वी कैन नॉट प्रोसेस आउट फोर्थ वन इज रिसोर्स प्लानिंग टूल प्लानिंग मशीनिंग टूल प्लानिंग विदाउट मशीनिंग टूल्स वी कैन नॉट प्रोसेस आउट फिफ्थ वन इज आर एंड डी रिसर्च एंड डेवलपमेंट टू इंप्रूव योर न्यू टेक्निक नंबर सिक्स एंड इंपॉर्टेंट स्टेप इज इंप्लीमेंटेशन एंड कंट्रोल फेज सो इंप्लीमेंटेशन दैट रिलेटेड टू ऑपरेशन सिक्वेंसिस एंड कंट्रोल फेज दैट रिलेटेड टू योर इंस्पेक्शन ओके ड्यूरिंग द प्रोसेस और फाइनल और आफ्टर कंप्लीशन ऑफ योर प्रोसेस सो थैंक यू थैंक यू सो मच इन दिस पर्टिकुलर लेक्चर वी हैव कंप्लीटेड प्रोसीजर ऑफ प्रोडक्शन प्लानिंग एंड कंट्रोल सो इन नेक्स्ट सेशन वी विल स्टार्ट सेल्स फॉरकास्टिंग टेक्निक एंड दैट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टेक्निक्स so thank you thank you so much